let me run a trailer for the film so people can get a flavor for it. Go. I can't seem to find anything but positive stuff on the Bidens. Who's the point pen for the foreign policy in the Obama regime? Joe Biden. So it looks like you need a billion dollars. So the obvious next question is, where's Hunter? I can remember getting paid some money, but I can't remember what for. Well, my dad says we never discuss my businesses, period. Or my cut. What's happening in there? Joe's in on it. Party's over! <laughs> you had everything, Hunter, and you threw it all away. You hope the laptop will take down everybody with you. Get out! China's not our enemy. They're not bad folks, folks. I love my dad, and I just want to make him proud. I am the one who brings in all the deals. I am the one. The boy. All right, so everybody can see that on uh, mysonhunter.com. Do you know how many people, Robert, have uh, watched it so far? Well, I know that the site crashed the first couple of days, and we are doing, uh, I don't have any figures from Breitbart, I ask, but I know they're doing beyond expectation, and people are very happy with it. So I'm, I'm waiting to get those numbers. It'll be our first week, I think, Wednesday or so. Uh, production it was values, at least the yeah, production values look good. How much did the movie cost to make? I think it was around two five which was crowdfunded by 30,000 people because people wanted the story to be told. It's, you know, look, we have, a, as you talked about, I mean, <laughs> President Trump gets investigated in New York City for his real estate dealings before president, but yet they don't want to, they don't want to investigate Hunter Biden and the impropriety I, there. I, yeah, it, they, it is. They, it's, it's staggering. I, listen, um, you put out a movie, people can watch the movie, they can make their own determination, as you said. I don't have any problem with any of that. I will try to catch up with the movie. Now, why I have you, I've known you for a while. Um, yes. And you were involved, uh, probably still are, in that Lincoln organization in Hollywood, right? Um, well, that, that kind of quieted, quieted down. It moved so what into was it? something else. What was the name of that? Uh, Lincoln uh, Friends Lincoln? of Abe. Friends of Abe. Okay, it used to be that that was an organization where actors and people in Hollywood who had conservative or uh, traditional beliefs met once in a while to kick things around. But yes. right now there's a blacklist in Hollywood. Uh, I'm yes. on it. I mean, I had five, I was the executive producer of five successful films. We yes. have great properties, a tremendous killing the mob. You couldn't oh, get a great. better cinematic property than that. <laughs> we can't do business in Hollywood. So no. you, uh, have always been conservative, but you've worked. I mean, you're a good actor. And, and now getting behind this Hunter movie, are you afraid you'll, you'll never get any work in Hollywood again? Absolutely. And there's been a blacklist to say that there hasn't. And the hypocrisy of Hollywood, Bill, is that they've done more movies about the Joe McCarthy era when traitors were coming into our nation, as proven by Daniel Patrick Monahan, a, Dem a Democratic senator, when he made the Venona Project public. And meanwhile, they're doing the very thing they, they condemned to patriots and people that think differently. I want to lead a movement in terms of diversity of thought. You can have transsexuals, black, Hispanics, everything. They say, okay, we want to go this way. We have to put more people there, but not diversity of thought. And Screen Actors Guild should be held accountable for that, my union, and Hollywood yeah. should be held accountable. People like Norman Lear, who is an elder statesman, should say, you know what, this is wrong. We shouldn't demonize people that think differently. Inflation at its highest level in 40 years. Interest rates skyrocketing. We all know that. Market experts like Jamie Dimon, CEO of J.P. Morgan, not only predict a recession, but are using scary terms like economic hurricane and unprecedented. So you need to call the only precious metal dealer I trust, American Hartford Gold. They will show you how to protect your savings and retirement accounts by diversifying your portfolio with physical gold and silver. Please call them today and they will have physical gold and silver delivered right to your door or put inside your IRA or 401k. They have thousands of satisfied customers of the highest rated firm in the country with an A-plus rating from the Better Business Bureau. Tell them Bill O'Reilly sent you and they'll give you up to $2,500 of free silver on your first order. 
Please call 866-501-5201, 866-501-5201, or text BILL to 65532. Again, 866-501-5201, or text BILL to 65532. Bill O'Reilly here. Thank you for watching this video and make sure you subscribe to the First TV YouTube page. Just hit the big red subscribe button below and you'll get clips and highlights of my program, The No Spin News, every single day. We'll see you soon.